Hey everyone, Eglin Team here from Video Do's and Don'ts to give you a quick message about theme songs for your LPS series. The biggest issue I have with theme songs is when they go on for too long. Because this is a YouTube series, at most, I'd say your theme song should be maybe 20 seconds. If you have a good theme song, then maybe up to 30 seconds, but 20 seconds is usually best when you are more of an amateur as far as filming and editing go. A lot of LPS series theme songs introduce the characters where they have a spotlight on the screen and their name pops up. You can do this if you want to, it's not bad, but I would recommend doing something a bit more creative. Maybe show some exciting scenes from your series and then have the title screen. If you are going to introduce your characters in the theme song, make sure the lighting is good so we can see your character, and make sure that when their name pops up, it doesn't look out of place or weird. Instead of popping up in the middle of the screen, maybe pop up in the corner. Also don't use bright colors for the font if there aren't bright colors in, the, in your filming portion. And make sure you spell your characters' names right. I have seen people who have spelled their characters' names weirdly, and if it's how they spell their name, if it's Hannah without an H, I get that, but if it's a badly made theme song, it just looks like you messed up how to spell your character's name. Also, only introduce important characters in your theme song. You don't need to include your character's parents, and don't put them in as Laura's mom, Laura's dad. Unless they are main characters, we don't need to know that. Only include the main characters you're focusing on, maybe one or two supporting characters, or an opposition character who is going to pop up. Like in LPS Popular, where we have Brooke and Savannah both in the theme song. And for your theme song, well, it's a song, make sure you use m music that fits your series and not just music that's popular. Don't use Shake It Off for a zombie apocalypse series. Don't use classical music for a high school drama series. Make sure your music fits your series and the concept of your series. Don't use Love Story by Taylor Swift if your high school drama series is about a girl getting bullied and has nothing to do with boyfriends or girlfriends or whatever. But some people tend to forget the most important part of a theme song, and that is to hook your viewers in. That's why they need to be creative. That's why they can't go on for too long. As soon as your theme song starts going on for too long, people are going to get bored. They're going to say, well, I'm just going to skip to the end, and then all your hard work will go to waste. Do make your theme songs short. Do use the music that makes sense for your series. If you're introducing characters, do use good lighting, do use the correct spelling of your characters' names, and do make it look pleasing to the eye. Thanks for watching this quick little video. I'm Aglantine, signing out.